All right, I got something to show you guys that I'm super excited about. Feet. <laughs> Hey friends, so last night we had some pretty intense thunderstorms, well it was a thunderstorm, and it rained pretty hard, and this morning we even had a little bit of hail, and so I'm a little concerned about my little plants that I put in the garden. Uh, I planted a bunch of little weaklings, so we're gonna go check it out and see if they survived. Also, pushing little girl, she's swinging. She loves to swing. All right, let's go see if they survived and what they look like. So it was also super windy all day yesterday, kind of leading up to the storm that was coming. So some of my uh, trellises that I put up for peas got knocked over. And these trellises I've never had any difficulty with. They're made out of an old crib, but look, they fell over. So I'm gonna have to set those back up. That's how strong the wind was last night. All right, so here's my collard greens. They're actually looking pretty good. So look at this guy. This guy's looking really good. See, onions, of course, are fine. Wasn't worried about them. Also, my radishes have just started coming up yesterday, or the really the day before I had a couple, but they'll be fine. I wasn't worried about them. But look how nicely they're coming up. These are my uh, ones I harvested from last year. These are coming up a little slower, but not by much. What are you doing? You need a boost? I think she needs a boost. Back and forth, back and forth. Being a mom and gardening. Ready? <gasps> you ready, pretty girl? And whee! All right, I moved her to the sandbox area to play. Let's check out my broccoli. These guys were pretty weak when I put them in here. They didn't have much of a root system or anything. I just kicked myself because I was taking good care of my seeds and all my starts. And I had put together a crate full of all of the ones that were doing really well, that were really thriving. And one night I just forgot it outside. I was like, oh, and it was a night where it was cold and they all froze. And so all my really, really healthy starts just so these guys were weaklings and I could already tell some of them not doing too good. I don't even see a plant anymore. <laughs> so that, oh, oh, there it is. I think I found it, guys. <laughs> see how little that guy is. Yeah, I think the stems broke. Well, we'll see. I'll leave him in here, just see what happens, but I don't think he's gonna make it. Something's already been eaten on it too. You guys see that? already just getting started all right so this was my healthiest looking one when i put it in so it's it's still looking pretty good this leaf does like to droop a little bit we'll see that one here is still intact it's been eaten on again oh i think this one's another one that might have got buried oh i think this guy might have snapped too all right i got something to show you guys that i'm super excited about and nervous all at the same time if that's possible so remember last video or the video about my onions freezing. I said we were going to possibly build some more beds. Well, we picked up a few things. A whole bunch of cattle panels for arches and trellises, and a whole bunch of wood to build some more boxes. It's pretty exciting. I'm like, is it my birthday or something? Look at all that. So excited! Yes! So, here, let me show you the garden. Okay, so here's the garden as is. Long garden. And we're gonna have beds coming this way out. So there'll be six beds on one side and six beds coming out on the other side with some trellises. Job, Joshua, you did really good. You did really good. Look at that. Look at that precision. I'm checking out. That. He got it spot on. He did. Good job, buddy. What do you think, Daisy, about all this? 
Huh? Uh. There it goes. You know, we were doing good till you came out. <laughs> All right, it is the next morning. I just want to show you what the guys got done. It is really cold. It's supposed to be cold and rainy the next few days, so we probably won't uh, get a whole lot done out in the garden. It's freezing right now. But they were able to get one box made and all the wood cut and prepped for the new garden beds. So they're going to be going along this row. It's pretty exciting. Anyways, um, I hope you guys will consider kind of uh, joining us on this journey. I hope to document and uh, share with you what we're doing. We're, uh, my desire and hope is maybe to turn all this garden stuff into some sort of business. Um, I don't know all the details of what that looks like, but uh, something, you know, where we're selling plants, selling produce, or cooking meals from the produce from the garden. Um, there's a lot of variables we don't have fully hashed out right now but um, we're wanting to do something uh, and uh, I hope maybe you guys you will join us along the journey of what we're planning to do and just see what unfolds I plan to do some more vlog type videos on here cooking videos um, garden videos but um, I'm gonna definitely add some more vlog just showing you what we're up to but here's some of the wood that got cut all right well until next time I'll see you guys later <laughs> bye